Hello, this is Nathan Smith. I'm going to take a few moments and show you how to download Audacity and the lame MP3 encoder and uh, install it on a Macintosh. So I'm going to do a Google search for Audacity. And the, the site that you want to go to is audacityteam.org. Sourceforge.net does have an Audacity page, but it's old and out of date. The Audacity team has moved over to this newer site. So click there, and we'll go to the Macintosh, and we'll click on this download right here. So I'll click. Here it comes. It's working on it. About 33 megabytes, so it's not too large of a file. Okay, I have that and I'm going to show it in the finder. And there it is. It's a .dmg file, which is a disk image. I'm going to double click on that. and that will load the disk image. I'm going to stretch this out just a little bit and drag this Audacity folder into my Applications folder. That is done. Alright, so if I go to my Applications folder, I will see an Audacity folder right there. And there's my Audacity application. I'm going to double click on it and I'll get this message. Audacity app can't be opened because it's from an unidentified developer. If you get that, what you need to do is control click or right mouse button click on the Audacity app and choose open from there. That will give you an open button. You only have to do this one time, and now Audacity's installed. And I can check it out and see if testing one, two, three, four, and it looks like it's it's working all right. So, okay. Now, problem is if I want to. If I want to export this audio and I want to do it as an MP3 file, it may ask you to use to download and use the lame encoder. Let me t show you about that real quickly. So if we go back to the Audacity page and down just a little bit, down here you'll see the lame mp3 encoder. I'm going to click on that and it tells me to go to the lame download page and this is what I want right here. So I want the installer package for OS 10 which is a Macintosh. I'll click on that. It has downloaded so I'll go back to my desktop here and to my downloads and there's the lame encoder. Double click on this package. It will open and you will be guided through installing it on your Macintosh. And that's all there is to it. So we'll go ahead and move that to the trash. We can eject these by highlighting them and right mouse button clicking on them and hit eject. 